Our top story sharing her pain, not as a Philadelphia police officer, but as a mother who lost her son. It was the worst call I could have ever received. I wasn't even able to get to my baby. And even being a police officer, my son was not exempt. Tonight, she wants everyone to know who her son really was. Good evening, I'm Jacqueline London. And I'm Jim Rosenfield. Officer Edwina Ferguson spoke candidly and passionately about her son's life and also about his murder. NBC 10's Aaron Baskerville was there. He's joining us now from police headquarters. Aaron, she also had a message for anyone who might be looking to avenge this killing, right? Yeah, Jim, uh, Jackie, Edwina Ferguson, she talked for a while. She had an awful lot to say. You heard right there off the top, even as a police officer, my son was not exempt. She's the mother, the Philly police officer who talked to us at FOP headquarters this afternoon. She's urging everyone to please let police do their jobs. It's me, Edwina, asking you, not Officer Ferguson. It's me, his mother. I don't know if you know him as Hiram H. Boop, whatever you call him, stand down. I'm begging you. Edwina Ferguson, backed by family and friends, telling those who loved her son to avoid revenge. 23 year old Hiram Hill was shot to death yesterday morning near Broad and Allegheny. Investigators say it was a robbery, but sources say they haven't ruled this out being a targeted killing. I was vacationing in the Poconos when I got the call. Hill had been working full time at Vision Quest in Newcastle, Delaware, mentoring kids. His mother, who's also a Philly police officer of 17 years, tells us her son was two semesters shy of graduating from Cheney University. I was proud of everything my son did. Every move he made, I told him, you take 10 steps, I'm going to take 50 for you. One, two, three, four. The West Catholic High graduate is one of the latest victims of homicide in Philadelphia. Ferguson noted she now stands with all other families going through this crisis. As an officer, she talked about the culture on the streets. So many people out here just want a name for themselves. Um... They do things, they don't think about the consequence. They don't think about how many families they hurt. Once again, a powerful message from a mother and a Philly police officer. Hiram Hill has a daughter on the way in just about two months. We're told there is now a $30,000 reward for any information leading to the arrest and conviction of the shooter. For now, we're live in Center City, Aaron Baskerville, NBC 10 News. So much pain. Hopefully, the mother's pleas were really heard tonight. Aaron, thank you.